started a uh, broadcast for uh, Fallout 4. Been doing pretty good, I guess. I know, I don't, I know that I don't usually, you know, do videos, but yeah, I don't know. It's fine. I just finished the the sh the, the silver shroud mission. I know I should have just shown it, but uh, well, what can you do about it? It's already too late now, so. <coughs> Yes, these those robots are quite dangerous. I fought one of those bastards, uh, actually multiple, and uh, I almost died from one of them. And I wasn't even wearing power armor at the time, so uh, those bastards are dangerous. That's for sure. Quite powerful, dangerous robots. So I just finished the mission. So, let's see, there is a silver shroud, it's me, Hancock, I go in there. Teleport there real quick. Oh, I'm almost done with it actually, with the silver shroud. So after this one, it should be the, should be the last mission. For every situation. But, uh, the thing is, Valentine's here, so I don't think he would like me stealing. I do know, like, one person from the companion stuff that would like me to steal, but of course, I don't have her with me. I sent this sanctuary hell, so. So I'm able to at least, you know, have, um. Uh. Might uh, stop by the memory den later. There was this girl. Let's go. Man, oh man. What if I see I just need time to recover, you know? Hey, I don't mean to bitch, but aren't you supposed to be heading to Pikmin Gallery for me? Something else you need? Looking for more work, if you got any. Nothing right now, sorry. But check around the neighborhood. Always something going on. I just need time to recover, you know? Wait, wait, wait. It says to go to the guy as the silver shroud. Ever tried chess? The deed Sometimes is done. The pieces. dreaded Sinjin breathes no more. Keep that in mind. All by your lonesome, you took down the big bad Sinjin. We get to walk that tightrope of freedom one more day. Take this for the effort. You played your part in serving justice to those most deserving of it. I'm gonna miss these little conversations. Ah, Ken, my man. Why the long face? You got what you wanted. I was t tortured. Almost died. It's not like the radio plays at all. Hey, who hasn't been tortured from time to time? The price of throwing down with the man is always a few scars. Pick yourself up. Good neighbors just a bit safer thanks to the two of you. What would the Shroud be without his faithful friend, Rhett Reinhardt? This... this means a lot to me. I'm gonna need some time to heal, you know? But then I got a special project in mind, just for you. I'll fire up my radio station if I make any progress. There it is. Itch. Done. Wait, did you have to do that? Ah, oh, you bitch. Hey, hey. Ah, yeah, back to the Okay. So, so what was the gallery for him, huh? That makes sense. If I want Hancock to be, um. Uh, So the gallery is this guy right here. So if I want him to be, you know, my companion, um, 
you know, I, I need to do that gallery thing. Well, for now, I'm not going to do that because, well, I'm going to have some companions beforehand. I could wait a little while for that, and then if I'm going to do that mission, then I would do Hancock. But for now, I'm doing Valentine's. And I did not know that each companion had perks on them. That's cool, you know. So first, I guess, let's put on my... My health. There we are. Pretty good outfit too. Cool set. And let's get the marine helmet. But of course, the thing is, this newspaper cap is a lot stronger than the helmet that I had for the marine. So, so now that I've done, I was going to see oh the glowing city find her in the glowing city. So this is oh the sea I mean. So this is where it has to be at. Huh. Must be this whole area. But for now, I'm going to do that alone for a while. It is optional. It is search influence to use the clues. Optional to use the to enter thing for me. So this one is at her house over here in Diamond City. Even good people do crazy things when they're scared. That'll be Diamond City's motto. Hanging out with Valentine. Good for you. Making some good things. That's like two out of ten points of danger tops. Now, if you want to talk something really deadly. Oh, I forgot you were there, Yakti. What is it? You know what? Never mind. I'll handle it myself. See this bar? I killed a man for it. <laughs> no, no. I kid. I kid. <laughs> he is dead, though. <laughs> now, let me know when you're ready to order. Earl Sterling used to work here, right? Poor Earl. Gone just like that. Such a good bartender. Good friend. Oh, <laughs> terrible with women, mind you. Bull in China shop with them. You with Valentine's Detective Agency? I forgot to drop off Earl's key when I hired you people. Here, I hope you find out what happened. Security does nothing but yell at me for asking about it. Anyway, you look like you need a drink. I'll think about it. Uh, all right. Wow, hey there. It's been a long time. How you holding up? Nick. Oh, hey. Yeah, we're doing all right. It's hard without Gwen, but it gets easier every day. Yeah, that's real good to hear. Well, I, I just wanted to check in. If you ever need anything, you stop by the office. Sure, you got it. Thanks, Nick. We'll you make something out of the Commonwealth yet. 
you understand me? God, even the sky is insane. Did you see that, uh, blimp thing? The Brotherhood of Steel? Who are they? Come, come. Get a drink. Nick? Hey there. Hi. Oh, a customer. Need a room? Did you know Earl Sterling? One of my brother's old friends. Oh, boy. The way those two would go on about girls, you'd think Vadim is loud now. Earl was a horrible womanizer, and I warned him more than once to leave the staff and customers alone. But my brother always stood up for him. Honestly, kind of glad he's gone. Wouldn't shut up about the new face he was going to get at the major surgery center. Vain till the end. Anyway, did you want a room? What's the story with this place? Not much to say. We sell food, drink, and rooms. Mainly for traders that come to the area. My brother Vadim runs the bar. Scarlet's our waitress, and she helps me keep the rooms clean. As much as they can be. I'll think about it. All right. Well, this thingy, man. You're never going to get... I'm never going to get that. Here, I activate it. Watch, look at this shit. Oh, oh, oh. Babe, don't pick it up. What's the point of this? Is it just to fuck with you? It's kind of messed up, don't you think? Is it... Oh. You're never... Like, no matter what, that's never going to be available to you. Hmm, there's a bunch of shit here. Hi there. Oh. You can order drinks and food here or at the bar. Did you work with Earl Sterling at all? Oh, yeah, Earl. Ugh. I mean, I know I shouldn't speak ill of the missing, but that guy needed to get out more. You'd think a bartender would be yeah, smooth, you know? Charming? Not Earl. He tried so hard, too. Way too hard. The real sad thing? He thought it was his looks. Kept talking about getting a new face over at the mega surgery. Wouldn't have helped. I should get back to work. Plenty of food and drinks available. Who owns this bar anyway? The Bobrov brothers picked this place up a few years ago. Uh, Vadim Bobrov is the loud one, Yefim Bobrov is the quiet one, and I'm the one that has to listen to them argue with each other all day. Just looking. Take your time. Interesting. Here's laundry. to take a look at that terminal you just say the word no, thanks but for now shit. no so if this is like one of the um, you know i should start exploring each part of the cities or little areas that are allied with me most of like diamond city is not allied with me but like because i don't think they can but who knows so okay so i'm locked now there we go. Search the house. Start in here. Why don't you check out the living room? Must be some hint where that boy ran off to. You know, for all the talk, I'd put the chances of this being an institute snatch job somewhere between zero and none. Just think about it. Earl Sterling, local assistant bartender. Why not nab the bartender himself? Lord knows Vadim samples his own wares enough that some weird behavior wouldn't make anyone bad an eye. This guy is coming over here. And Earl had lousy people. So might score the Institute some points in the last person you'd ever suspect category. Why not snatch someone with charm? Someone who could get you what you want. Earl could barely get you a drink by closing on a busy night. So where'd that leave us? No, no. Enemies. Wasn't much for the great outdoors, so likely not raiders or mutants. No, this all screams accident. Now, what was Earl into? Might have gotten him in this kind of trouble. Hello. Hey, give 
Come here. I think I found something. Hey, Valentine. Looks like you got something to say. You seeing what I'm seeing over here? A receipt from the Mega Surgery Center, huh? I wonder what the good doctors have to say about that. Hmm, interesting. Looked around, couldn't find it. He got the surgery that he wanted. Oh. There's an awful lot of blood leading into the surgery center basement. Should try and find a way down there. Doctor. This better be an emergency. Care to explain all this blood leading to the cellar? Dr. Crocker must have tracked some fluids when he went down into the cellar. He's sometimes not as fastidious as I am between surgeries. Here, the cellar key. Go check for yourself. I'm sure you'll find there's nothing going on here besides medicine. Well, I was able to get my charm hella up, and then because of the goggles or the oh, like. Earl, you've you've really been a handful, you know. But I think we're just about done. Our little mistake is finally going to be corrected. Oh, naughty, naughty! You're not supposed to be down here. What did you do to Earl Sterling, Doctor? What did I do? Uh, Good patients get a nice new face. Bad patients bleed all over the floor because they want to screw up their surgeon's life. You killed a man, doctor. You're gonna pay for it. Put the gun down and come with me. Now let's not do anything rash. Huh. I... I did it, didn't I? I killed a man. Oh. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much blood. So much blood all over me. I can fix anything. Uh. What's going on here? Is, is that Dr. Crocker? I think you owe me an explanation. What happened here? Doc Crocker killed Earl Sterling. I found out, and then he killed himself. I guess he couldn't handle the guilt. Dr. Crocker killed Earl? The, the facial reconstruction. So he really did go through with it. That explains a lot more than I'm comfortable with. Dr. Crocker always cared about his reputation, but this, this is inhuman. You didn't know. It's not your fault. Of course it's not my fault. That moron and his damn appearance over practice mentality. Now two lives have been lost. It's disgraceful. I better report all this to security. Get out of here. It's going to take a long time to clean this place of biohazards. We'll be taking Looks like it'll be a closed casket funeral. Yeah, well, that's fucked up, man. So that would happen to him. What if we know what happened to him now? We can't blame ourselves. That man decided to die. Hey, I think those Bobrov brothers are looking for you. 
they are? Well, you know, at least we know what happened to that guy, sadly. He died a horrible death. He got his arms cut off, fucking head cut off. It's fucked up, man. Guess we ought to give her the news. Miss Perkins. So, you two find out where Earl Sterling ran off to? Earl never went anywhere. Doc Crocker killed him during a botched surgery. Crocker killed Earl? Not as long as he was, I figured maybe Raiders or the Institute, but Crocker? Where's the doc now? Rotting in a cell, I hope. Crocker killed himself. Couldn't take the guilt. Goodness. I'm sorry you two had to go through that. Here, take this. Sounds like you earned it. I'll send word along. Let everyone down at the dugout in know what happened. Shame it couldn't be better news. Thanks again for closing this one out. Uh, yeah, I kind of feared that he would like me doing his own missions. Well, let's do enough missions for Valentine until he actually, you know. So I saw something on the missions. Most like is this. Let's talk to the brothers. Makes sense as well. After learning what having to do his thing. It sucks that not many people actually like them. Well, it sucks, but I guess they really didn't like him too much, I guess. That's kind of messed up. I guess that's how it is, I guess. It's a lot more roomy in there than I thought. It was pretty, you know, a small area. I haven't really been down into like a real life, you know, dig out place, like in a, a baseball place. You know, I've been at like a, I think I was at a baseball place before, but never seen the inside of it. Oh, here we go. Try it, Nifty. All right, you. Tell me. Diamond City Radio? It's terrible, yes? It makes you want to cut your own ears off. Mm. So, what's the issue? Have you not listened? This DJ Travis, he's terrible. It makes me want to go back in time and prevent radio from ever being invented. But damn. It's true! Don't listen to my brother! Someone needs to get rid of him! We need a new DJ for the radio! I don't think many would notice if he, you know, disappeared. Are you serious? Did we not just agree this is serious problem? Calls for serious solution. First, you get him to follow you out of town. If oh, this is a joke, that's you're enough. One sick Let him puppy, isn't buddy. serious. He doesn't really want to kill Travis. Okay, what's really going on here? <laughs> Sorry, we were just joking around a bit. <laughs> it's true. Only jokes. Travis is a good friend. Yet him and I worry about him. Well, Travis, he, he means well, but he does not have the confidence he needs for that job, or anything else, really. And so he's always awkward. He does not believe in himself, you see? He expects he will fail at everything, and so he does. Well... That can always be turned around. Exactly. This is what I'm telling you, Kim. Go on, spoil sport. Go back to working. We will figure out how to help Travis. Come, you. Meet me in back room. We discuss plan. The mall's sure looking good lately. Guess I haven't found some more paint. Just stop, okay? We got our own problems. Wow. I, I can't believe Doc Crocker killed Earl. Glad I only ever had to deal with Doc's son. Okay, let us get down to brass tacks. I am glad you are willing to help. Unlike my deadbeat brother. Travis is a good guy. 
He deserves better life. I'd be happy to help. Okay, so Travis needs to believe in himself, yes? Believe he is capable of more. You know what works well for this? <laughs> A bar fight. Ever been in one? Haven't met a man I couldn't lay out. As a last resort, no doubt. Excellent! Because you are going to help Travis win his first fight. Uh, I want to stage fight here in Dugout. Nothing too serious. Uh, we make sure Travis wins and feels good about himself after. I want you to be there to help make it look real. What do you think? Sound good to you? I'm on board. When do we start? Why not soon as possible? I have contacts. People I can count on. Real tough looking. But they will take a dive for money. They confront Travis here at dugout. You step in and keep him who she needs to stand up to them. Then you and Travis take them down. Nothing gets too rough. And Travis is something he can feel good about. Simple, right? I have everything ready by six o'clock. Travis should be here by then. You show up and it will go well. Promise. So I need travel to Tintinot Inn after 6 p.m. Nice pit boy. It's 9 a.m., so that's around six hours. No, it's seven hours. It's 6 p.m. Oh, wait, no, I did it wrong. <laughs> I'm bad with math. I'm very bad with math. I'm a dumbass, I swear. So, two hours I could wait, actually. I forget that it doesn't add up like that. Okay, that should be good. This must be it. Interesting. Some writers. Oh. How do I, um... What's this about? I don't like you, and I don't like your radio. What you gonna do about it? <laughs> hey there, pal. I'm only here for a drink. Oh, it's you. Okay. I'm here to give you a hand. I, I, I mean, I'm not really looking to cause, you know, trouble. Uh, I don't! I have no idea! What I did to deserve this! I just wish they'd go away. Come on, man. Take a stand. Don't chicken out here. I, I don't think I, I could uh, do that thing that you're describing. <laughs> With these men, it could, well, it, it, could, it could turn violent. Don't worry. I've got your back. Well, if you think it would work... You got spunk, kid. That's all that matters. Okay. That's... Well, that's enough. Oh, I'm sorry. You say something. I said... I said that's enough. Leave me alone. <laughs> Look at you. Hmm, let me think about that for a second. 
Nah, I don't think so. I, I mean it. Leave me alone. Well, sounds like you were thinking about saying, or else. <laughs> were you, Travis? Were you gonna say, or else? I'm wondering what comes after that. What you gonna do, little man? How do I, um, how do I, um, I don't understand, how do I pull my fist, you know, my fist, how do I pull my fist, do I have to have a weapon or something, because I can't do shit, man, I don't, like, art, um, no, favorite, sword, R3, no, that doesn't help. Oh, I messed up this shit. What the hell? I don't know where it goes with anything. But, um... Okay. How do I do a fist fight, though? Or start fighting? Destroy you and your friend here. Get Are lost. This ain't over. There. You hear me? Travis. Whoa. I, I can't believe it. We did it. I knew you had it in you. I can't, I can't believe it. You were right. Whoa. I've, I've got things to do now. Listen, really, I, I can't thank you enough. There he is! Yeah! We did it! <laughs> I think that went well! <laughs> Ready for the next part of foolproof plan? Bring it on. Good attitude. It's nice and easy. You have seen Scarlet, yes? She has worked here for some time. Now, I am just simple bartender, but I see things. I see how Travis looks at her. And I see that sometimes she looks at him. If someone who was not her employer suggests that she go spend time with Travis, it might do him some good. I could have a chat with her. <laughs> yes, I know. This is why I'm telling you. Just do whatever it takes to get her to agree to see Travis, and this will all be worth it. And you and I never talked about this, all right? Let me ask you something. Sure. Ask away. It's just, uh, with everything that's happened with you and your, your family, it's a whole hell of a lot to process. I, I wanted to make sure you're holding up all right. Yeah. I'm all right. Huh. You're a tougher nut than I thought. Tougher than I was. Took me a long damn time to get a feel for this place. Thank goodness I found Diamond City. It's got its flaws, sure, but it beats the hell out of anywhere else in the Commonwealth. Of course, when I took up there back when, people were just as scared of the Institute as they are now. Maybe more. The massacre of the CPG was still pretty fresh in people's minds at that point. And folks were still losing sleep over the broken mask. Plenty of people assumed I was just a saboteur, moving in to melt down the reactor or poison the drinking water. 
But at the time, they couldn't exactly turn me away. Why'd they let you in? Because I'd rescued the mayor's daughter. Gal of about 15. Pride and joy of the mayor back then. Man by the name of Henry Roberts. The young Miss Roberts decided she'd run off with some caravan hand she'd uh, <clears throat> known for an evening. Turns out the guy was part of a gang of kidnappers. I didn't even know who I was rescuing. Just stumbled on a crying girl and four tufts. I took her home and the mayor dubbed me a hero, offered me a place in town. Lots of folks protested, said I was a spy, but he wouldn't have it. Taking up in the city was tricky at first, but I never tried to hide what I was, and people seemed to warm to that. Was it hard, settling in? Well, they sure didn't make it easy. I started off doing the jobs no one else wanted. I got more banged up being Diamond City's handyman than I ever did living out in the ruins. But I guess folks never forgot I rescued the mayor's daughter, so they started coming to me when people went missing. Wife runs off with a new paramour and takes the rent money with her. Talk to the simp. An upset father decides moving him and the kids to good neighbor in the dead of night's not the worst damn idea since the bomb. Go get Nick. After a while, the jobs got so backed up, they didn't even ask me to do the handyman stuff anymore. Hell, I was so happy to do it, it was months before I started charging anyone. I never stopped being Nick the synth, but it was Nick the detective folks came to see. It was about then that things, uh, well, things finally started feeling normal. It took me a long time to realize that home is where you make it. And with some time and effort, this place can be home for you, too. That's a long story, but I hope it helps. Want to get moving? Looks good. You'll get used to Diamond City security being unhelpful. <laughs> Damn, okay, lady. Just ignore him like I do. Ugh, irritation is a problem, that's for sure. But at the same time, that's how the game is. If you don't get that perk to get the reiteration, or you can become a ghoul. break right now actually I'd like to talk to you about Travis if you have a moment Travis really did he did he mention me yeah I heard about the fight Travis was well he was brave yeah absolutely you should really pay him a visit you think I mean, I've definitely noticed him. Maybe... No. No, I couldn't just go over there. Look, Travis is a nice guy. I can tell that you like him, and I think he likes you. Just go talk to him. Okay, I will. I'll go see him now. Thanks. Hey, hey, I got it. I love this. I like that I did that, man. Look, 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 look. I like that I actually decided to get charm very high up. You see? It's quite high up there, so I could convince a lot of people. And not just that, the Black Widow effect, too. I like that, I, of course, the thing is, it's very beneficial fighting, of course, the men of the combat thing. And then the best thing is that it's much easier to persuade him. And they're easier to purify uh, with the signature perk. So it's actually quite a thing. And I don't think that's just it either. I believe I actually have some special pieces of 
armor, one, well, one, and that is this one, the goggles. Well, the goggles wear the pretty thing. So red is like the um, perception, so this. So technically, imagine I have technically two more levels to really link up. And then actually, I do have other one, and that is this green boy, that's charm, and this one too. These two do the charm. So that's two extra and an extra end. The end is endurance and two extra charm equal to technically I have a full set. So I have a bunch and of course my persuasion is quite high. It's true but I'm not too it's not too bad to have this type of this gear that I have so on. So it's true then? You win for me. Good for you. Great cause. Yeah, thanks. I remember wearing that armor, this ar that armor rifle that they have. The armor was actually pretty good for early game. I did kill the guy though, but it didn't matter at the time. And the armor hey, you were the one that walked that freedom trail, right? That's good. So, wait. Yeah, it's not that hard to persuade people, so I should go around. Diamond City to see people. Need new clothes? Then stop by Fallon's basement. Hey, Yafim. Open during the this day. This is terrible. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. He was up to no good, and look what's happened now. You've got to help. I can't do it. You've got to help me. Take it easy. It'll be all right. Just tell me what happened. They took him. They took Vadim. Th those men, th the ones that messed with Travis, they came back. Said Vadim owed the money, that they had a deal. He, he wouldn't pay, and then they grabbed him and said that they would make him pay. And then they just dragged him out. You have to do something. Please tell me you can do something. I'll bring him back, Yefim. Count on it. Please just bring him back. He's an idiot, but he's my brother. I'd go with you, but someone has to stay here. Talk to Travis. Maybe he knows where they took him. Travis. Travis did look a little bit sad normally, man. Look at him, he's super depressed and shit. And definitely fucking shy. Like, at least I'm not like that, but still, it's kind of, uh... You know, I don't like Hope you didn't run into any trouble. Sad, I guess. I wouldn't really try to be that fucking sad. Oh, so this is the radio station, huh? I should have been I should have been looking around a little bit before I did it. Hey there. What's going on? I need your help. Vadim's been kidnapped by Bull. That's not funny. I'm not joking around, Travis. This is serious. I really do need your help. Wait. Really? Oh. Oh man. Wow, is this This is because of what happened. Isn't it? It's... it's my fault. No, Travis. This is between Vadim and those men. It's not your fault. But if I hadn't gotten into that fight with them, maybe this wouldn't have happened. Don't beat yourself up, kid. You saw how things turned out last time someone tried to. Look, I don't... I don't really... I mean... I don't have a lot of friends. If Vadim is missing... Or in trouble, or whatever, then I'm gonna help get him back. All right. I'd welcome the help. Good. I didn't. I didn't want to have to argue about it with you. I've heard enough to know they're probably holed up at the old Beantown Brewery. We gotta go in there, show them we mean business, and and then we can bring Vadim back, and everything will be okay. Right? I'll... I'll get a gun, and I'll meet you there. We'll settle this. Damn, look at him. Being brave as hell. I'm on a break right now. Bitch! A oh, bitch said that already. Kinda happy, kind of. I don't have any work. Bitch, I don't need your life story. So, let's see. So... This? Really? This far away at the brewery? Right now. Damn, alright. I guess I head there then. 
already been there, lucky enough. I should start exploring a little bit more of the land. I'm level 60, so... <laughs> yeah, level 60 is quite a high level to continue playing the game. There's a lot of missions to the show. Now level 60, 60 things perked up, leveled up, I mean, with the perk list. Uh, it could become higher level to level up everything else, at least. Oh, there he is. Oh, thank God. You're here. So this is it. Odds are, if they've got Vadim, he's inside. We're... We're gonna be okay, right? Definitely. We'll be fine. Okay. Okay. Good. I mean, I can do this. Totally. Hey, you can do this. Any, uh, any last minute advice? I've never done anything like this. Just stay calm. Don't go crazy in there. Right. Calm. I can do calm. Calm, 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 calm. Okay, can we just get in there before I totally lose my nerve? Horrible gun, but hey, I was in this terminal before. It oh, nothing useful, just a burr, burr, uh, the alcohol information. <laughs> why are they? Why are they punching? Oh, there's the guy that's shooting. Start fucking loading up shit, man. Fucking reload this shit. All right. Oh, there he is. One shot kill, bitch. He's up above. Oh. Down. Okay, where's that guy with the red shirt? Is he alive still? I hope he is. I don't want him to be dead. Oh, yeah, he's still alive. Good. So, he's somewhere over here. <clears throat> Thank you. I didn't know if anyone would come. I thought perhaps this is the end. Uh, thank you, thank you. You are a true friend. You're welcome, Vadim. We weren't going to leave you to these guys. You are a good woman. <laughs> these idiots. 
had caps and cams just lying around. <laughs> they, they did not notice when I filled my pockets. You deserve what I took. Ah, I promise. I am surprised to see you here. <laughs> hey, Vadim. I'm glad you're safe. How did you get roped into this? I, I wasn't thinking. I wanted to help. <laughs> yes. Look at that. You are full of surprises, my friend. Hi. Man. What a day, huh? Hey, listen. I wanted to say thanks. This has been... Well, it's been crazy. But I've learned a lot, I think. You came through it all pretty well, Travis. That's good to hear. Thanks. You've come real far, pal. After all this, I think about the things that had me worried so much, and it just seems... silly, you know? Like, was I really that worried about just being on the radio? That's nothing compared to being beaten up, shot at. I can do so much more. And I need to. Anyway, thanks again. I owe you. Damn, man, there it is! Look at him! Confident! Confident person, though. Now we go to a little diamond radio station. You could see if he actually, you know, became quite confident. I guess I could start looting up from this area again. There's not a lot of stuff in here. Well, there is, but I looted up one time, but I don't mind looting it up again. There's a bunch of beer. I wouldn't mind taking it if I was an alcoholic, but really ain't much of that in real life or in the game. And you could become quite a kick. Oh, oh what was that? Ah. Oh. Here, let's drop that fucking piece of shit gun real quick. No one likes that piece of shit guns. The water, the radiation, blah blah blah. This mansion right here. Ooh, I can take it. Hell yeah. Accountant for taste. I guess I could leave now. I don't really care too much about this area. I've already been here before. But hell yeah, man. We got him. He's more more confident. Boy. But how the fuck did he know, anyways? About, like, what did he hear from? Like, it's crazy, like, he's able to hear it. And, uh, but whatever, I guess. Fucking bullshit. So. There is another mission that I was thinking, but I don't want to really do it too much. It's because of the Brotherhood of Steel. Uh, let's see. Secure the DII sword? It's over here somewhere. So, is that Vault 75? Huh. I don't remember being there. Oh, but I do remember this town. It is quite dangerous. I remember there are su some super mutants. And, of course, some ghouls, too, so. mind well there's some sense here actually instead you know I should actually go into the fucking hey automatic one huh? sucks that the automatic one is not that? good at all 
like doing uh, automatic is cool. Give me that mini nuke, bitch. Useless. I headshotted this guy. Or just killed him instantly, I mean. Good fight, human. You die well. See that? He's on that side, he's broken. Not good. Okay, at least he doesn't at least he doesn't fucking kill me. I don't think I would have been able to kill him on time. Oh here, what? Who's there? Someone there? A bunch of grenades. Let's start using them. Oh, up there, buddy. There you go. Take that. Kobe. Kobe. Hey, hey, stop. Stop moving. Fucking jerk. Moving. Not getting killed by my grenades. Fucking jerk. There you go. There you go. Take that. Hey, take that. There you go. Hmm. I have to unlock that again. Crystal. And I can't run anymore. Great. You won't kill shit. Come here. Here, take this shit. Oh, that's the wrong one. Give me that. Or carry a few handful of stuff. So far, you can. Yeah, you took everything. Awesome. Alright, let's keep looking around, see if there's any useful materials. Yep. Oh, look. Oh, look. You had your time, human! Alright, let's, uh, let's open this little bit up. Yes. Dangerous. Got it. First, second try action. Right up. Right on. On duty. Oh, so that amount of time liked me hacking. Ah, oh, I guess that makes sense. I do have this thing unlocked already. I know what this is. I know what. I know this room. Don't worry about it. Okay, nice. There you go, bitch. Oh. There you go, take that. Uh oh. Yeah, you saw him, he fell down the stairs. He tripped. Where are you going? Doing. Is that a short? What does this do? This one reminds me of that. Oh, I know what this is. Huh. I've already been in here before, so it's not much of a big difference. Oh, no wonder. How much ammo do I have for this left? A lot. I'm glad, at least. Super armor. I should start actually carrying this out, because I am going to, you know, use strong. 
I really want him to start wearing some like, armor. Ammo. I'm saving my ammo for like other guns. This is like the most common, well not the most common, but one of the most common ammo that I have so far. that I completed? Oh, I need to report back to her. Oh. So that's about it, huh? I guess that's about it. Sweet. Wow, first try too. First try too. Wow, I thought I was going to take a little while. I like that I have the four chances before, um... Yeah, you can smell me, huh? Easy, Ronald. All right, time to come kill you, dead bastards. Come here. Come here. Where are you at now? Where are you at? Down! I know I have syringes. I want to waste my purified water beforehand. Damn! Is this dog is here now? Yes. No, I have a thing for fucking materials I need for my fucking settlements so I can start building some badass robots too. Hey, here. here's what I've got. Yeah, I know. Wait up. Oh, can't take any more. That's it. That's all I could take. Can't take any more. Do I have any weapons on me that I am not really trying to keep? I think I might get rid of this one, but... Um... Is there any? Oh, I guess. There's this one. It's not worth anything. But there's this one. Well, that's the one that I've been using, actually. But there's this other, other um, assault gun. This one is a pretty good one. It has a silencer on it. I'm not too sure what having the silencer would be better or worse on this gun that I have on me right now. I really don't know, so... Yes, what's that indeed? Yes, I'm a super mewin, rubber bra. Brain keys, face. Oh, what's up, Valentine? Where do you come from? Well, because I took care of these guys. To die. Camera. What? I hear something. Yes. Oh, I can't get back up that way. Oh, here we go. That's the way we leave. See ya, bitches. I'm out. I know it's the alien gun. Uh, is that I could save the alien blasters, but the thing is, I want to save that. I want to be using it. 
Because after a little while, there's no, there's gonna be no point in using it, and then until you could use it to the fusion cells. But afterwards, that's like, I don't run, I don't want to use it, so I'm going to be using the ammo. But I want to save the ammo as well, so like, actually using it on someone is quite fucking important. Because a bunch of stuff has happened, I'm going to Sanctuary to start dumping some of my stuff. So I did add two more people to Sanctuary, and that's the other two companions of like Strong and the lady. I forgot her name, but if I'm gonna be doing that machine building thing, it's a good, a good idea to actually do it. Yeah, at one place would be good, but I think I might do it at the fort. The reason why at the fort of like the Minimin. Is because I am planning to Enough make this some slot. robots and Just point us to the nearest water and hole. Hey. There's something you need? Take all? Leave hmm. that jump behind. Heads You're up. just wasting space. What? Okay, so he had something of his that I took from him that I feel like it sh I should not have taken everything. Where's the gun? I don't remember picking this up. Maybe this is his, I guess? What's the plan? So we're all junk in here. Why are these people sitting here and not like, you know, standing up or, I mean, Can't sitting somewhere wait to else? Get out of Goddamn heat. World is bigger than strong new. So much walking. Want to do more fighting? Point? I'll shoot. Pretty simple arrangement. Okay, let's see. Grenades that I'm not planning to uh, use, not yet at least. Forehand. We find milk of human kindness soon. Uh, I'm going to get rid of the suppressor because I actually don't have it. So there's a middle scope. This is the one that I've been using. It's pretty good. So this is a quick one, huh? I thought I would have any like any stuff for this. I guess I don't. I thought I did. Just not. I guess they came with the stuff anyways. Road and a loaded weapon. Doesn't get much better than this. I want to check everything if I have any mods. I do not. Okay. Nope. No mods. No mods. Just and there's appearances, but not mods. Anything like that. No mods either. I checked everything. This one definitely shouldn't have any mods. Okay. Um. I guess the first thing is actually just put away the. This one away. Have these stuff, so let's put those away as well. I guess this is a special one. Wait, what am I doing? What am I putting? What am I putting clothing in the fucking the weapon? Actually, it might be a good idea actually beforehand to go to him beforehand because I'm not too sure on myself. I'm pretty sure that I cleared that place out.
already. Let's just fucking go kill these bastards. Man, it sucks. My mic's going to die soon, man. It's a low battery. Huh? Hearing shit. Yeah, yeah, you are. Whoa, shut the fuck up. Oh, damn. One shot, bitch. Oh, oh, fuck you, bitch. Ah, ah. Got you, got you, bastard. Got him. Damn. I saw, oh, the guy, well, uh oh. Well, ain't that a so the trap was right here. Damn. Still alive. Oh. Anybody now. Yeah, make sure not to use all the ammo. Well, I have to. And then I'll start using that thing. I wonder when you do switch it to the other ammo, what happens anyways? This is alien blaster gun ammo, so you won't be able to get it ever again. So it's pretty cool. Having an alien blaster. You know, I thought about it. Is that I believe you could get the alien gun right early in the game. To get, like, an early gun. Because it's not, it doesn't require, like, a mission. You could just wake up and start heading there and get some good start-off weapons. The alien gun actually is pretty good for a starter game. Starter.
Hi. With that latest one, Mila's got good coverage of the Commonwealth. Could always use more Mila's place. If you're interested. Or we could just do some business. Let's see what you got. Oh, you got it. Pam, I took care of the DIA cache. Interface. That's great, Agent. Those provisions will really help Organization Railroad. Here's your reward. Have a good day. Based off what Deacon said, I expect great things from him. I'm a safe house busy. as Malden's clean. Unless you need my medical Glad expertise, please bother someone else. If you need something, take it. That's what it's there for. Old North Church. Right. Uh, I am getting a little hungry. It's already 7.30 over here where I'm at. Uh, I guess I should start heading that way, huh? Got this sword to me to be one of the best melee weapons. Of course, that's for my medium sized one. If I want for like a large one, I wouldn't mind trying out that big ass slash hammer. The one that I got from the Adam people. It looks cool, man. Very much so. So it's gonna be pretty cool to use it when I, when I decide to use it. Power armor is worth it, that's for sure. I already have it. I already have power armor. I need to find one more set of armor. At least one more. Ugh. I need one piece of armor to complete the X. The X01 model. I, I'm missing the leg, sadly. I have the head. I stole it from the Brotherhood, but... I'm missing a leg, so. But the Brotherhood is powerful based on what they have. At the same time, the Institute is dangerous because of the technology. They don't send anyone out, mostly the robots, and they teleport. And it makes sense why no one has ever found it. Oh, well, look at that! 
So it seems that there is something I missed. That I didn't realize that I missed. I guess I missed something over here at the airport. Okay, I believe I can make it. Somewhere around right here. <laughs> Got it. Man. What the fuck did I just see? Why are you getting comfortable that time? Huh? Go get me some fucking shit. Broken terminal. If it's broken, why can't I use it then? <laughs> I could play I could play it on the fucking thing. I just play on my fucking big boy man. The Pip Boy is awesome, I like it man. If it wasn't something in real life, I would actually buy it. I know that's super fucking huge, but look at it. It's a little computer in your fucking thing. Like with hollow tapes and shit like that, if that becomes something in the future... Oh, I would definitely fucking buy it, I don't lie. So, I just bought, or... Just added this container that actually is quite useful aluminum and oil it's not too bad it's better than nothing really mm 
cow. Some bees. That. That. Alright, let's see. Duct tape, lighter fluid. Oh, actually. That could have actually used it before. What is this right here? A strange device? Hmm. I don't think that's a good idea. Not yet, at least. Let's look around beforehand. It is strange, that's for sure. But it might be a good idea to hold off on that for a little while. So there is a... Fire Ock there. Well, I haven't seen any enemies so far. Terminal. Required to use? Found it, I mean. Yeah. Terminal. And that's it. Here. <laughs> I get, oh, okay. Yeah, pretty much, I guess. Pretty much. Yeah, it is surprising because people in the world actually stop actually doing the... Um, review. Heck, this object is already being used by someone else. Mom, Dad, Jerry, I don't think so. Rugwood arm, pieces, that, stuff like that. There's some other reboot thing. And here's the other one. I don't see the purpose of it, but I don't need it right now. And that's it. I exit to the common one after. afterwards. So this one's within the computer area, huh? Burn magazine. Wouldn't doubt that I missed a handful of fucking comics while I was uh, while I was exploring. But it is all right because I don't really care. Nothing else is here but this door and this strange device. I guess I'll quick save it beforehand. If anything happens, I should be prepared at least. That's strange. That's strange. Very much so. I guess the, the A lot of people out here need a hand. Heads up. Go on. Go check that out. Count on it. Good to think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check it out. Can do. That's strange. Hmm. Interesting. I believe this is, I what I think it is is most likely the answers to. I wouldn't doubt it, but I don't know. I am just saying it, but I have no idea. Well, I guess that's it. This was a little area, and I got it down. I've been trying to explore every area in the Commonwealth. Of course, so far I've been exploring this area before I uh, continue exploring within the, um, the rest of it. Because right now I've been exploring mostly the city, the uh, outskirts, mostly the top of the map so far, but in the some of the bottom of the map I haven't really gotten started with except like certain parts, but I should start doing, like start exploring that part too, because who knows when I'll be down there, you know what I mean? But for example, you see that I have this whole area down over here, everything is 
down over here. But everything below, like this area and this area, has been, you know, hasn't been completed yet. The farthest that I've been down here is like here and I still need to head here for like a dead drop for the railroad. So there's reporting that one recover that's in high tech. Head there real quick.
What's that? Look alive. If I got it.
Look alive. Take them. They're here somewhere.
second, alright. Pretty good. Seems pretty good, I guess. Could be worth a lot because how much look how much it costs. However, I can't carry it because of my weight, sadly. <clears throat> yeah. That was a waste. How do I get up here? Let's look around real quick. Ammo. Duct tape. More duct tape. And up here maybe? Yep, here we go. Damn, that guy is destroying me. I'm coming for you bastards, don't worry. How much does he have? Of that asshole real quick. Let's do it. Oh look at him! Oh, cool man. You fucking did a superhero landing. That's what you have, buddy. A drag grenade, some cells, and a militia hat. He has a minimum outfit? He's a bad guy though. Pretty cool with glasses. Perception. So, oh look at that! Ooh, perfect man. That's the whole suit of that I needed for the 15... <clears throat> for the 15 one armor, sadly. However, I don't think I'm going to be able to carry it at all. Not all of it at least. There's, oh, there he is. Here's what I've got. Can you carry anything else? Please tell me you can. Oh, he can! Okay. I need him to at least carry one more thing that weighs a little bit of 8 pounds or something. This one could work. He can't carry it anymore. Son of a bitch. Alright, what does he have that I do not want? He has some weapons. Well... This one, I don't think he... I don't think... Okay. So this one no, this one no, and this one. Drop in that one. Drop in that one. I picked up another weapon, where is it at? Oh, the pistol, yeah, here we are. That. Carry a little bit more, so that would be one of the. So take that, and can't carry the other one. Okay, that should be good for now. So I'm going to kill whoever, and then I'm going to head back to my home to drop off that stuff. Mini nuke, awesome. Damn. I really do not like me at all here. Hey, this area reminds me of that one... Ooh. Hell yeah. Ah. This reminds me... Oh, that's why. Admires me. Nothing there. Nothing. Uh -huh. All right. Let's head back down and start killing these gunners. 
thanks for that Valentine. I don't think we're alone. No, we're not. There he is. Damn, that's a headshot. Everything is still couldn't do anything. Sometimes this is why I don't like the sniper rifle because it can't do shit without like hurting. This guy is cool. It seems that he's a porn too, but these glasses, uh, I'll think about them actually because I wouldn't mind wearing something different like that. Hmm. I want to see if this one actually could have like a ballistic wave stuff. Sometimes I need to look for like different outfits that I wouldn't mind looking for. Different hats, different glasses, and different masks or stuff like that. That's what's cool. Why was this up here? Okay, where are you enemy? Where are you? There's that guy. movement while aiming. Ooh. That could come in handy. Of course it's hard to say which one actually is the better one. What the hell? The Miniman stuff. Why is the Miniman thing here? This must have been one of their old bases. Make, it kind of makes sense because, well, they did, that guy right there, up there actually had like a, you know, a, um... A pan aluminum. Place I like to dawdle. What is this? Chemistry. What is this terminal? It's just terminal. Nothing. It's a terminal. If I took out your leader, I don't think you're going to stand much of a chance against me, by the way. And he's the one that had power on him, yes. by the way. I'm just wondering, like, what the hell is going through your mind, thinking that you even stand a chance? So... Oh, that's enough. This guy, man, he grabs random weapons all the fucking time. I like that, man. It's cool. There's a cooking area. I kind of forgot that it, that one time could actually carry more if he picks it. It up so I can give him one other piece of uh, my something out. Where is he at? There he is. <laughs> Nothing there.
interesting. Uh, I just came to this wall over coming that way, huh? Damn it! So this was the other way to get up here, and I, of course I took the other way, that one right there, but... Let's look around for the people that are dead and look for their bodies so I can start looting them. Okay, well, I'm done. You're okay. So, who died in this area? We ought to grab that. Good thing. Get that. Good plan. This is definitely one of the biggest locations of like the, the gunners. How stupid just to believe that. Been an, it would have been this weapon right here. I was shot, but lucky enough, I already grabbed it beforehand, so. Let's see what else. Uh. Okay. 
Oh, nope, none of the hats or stuff that I have collected is able to do the ballistic, ballistic stuff. So this hat, no, sadly, cannot do anything. Gotta find the terminal. Gotta be somewhere. in here that it was so important lock up combat knife I don't understand why this room was so important for, you know, to be barged up like that. Well, whatever, I guess. I keep looking around to see if there's anything left that I fucking didn't grab. Or didn't loot up. Looking around all over this place just in case I missed something. They had no prisoners. I've been told. 